Welcome to Dream Kikes. This is the Warhorse, taken for its maiden voyage. First spin, saddled it all up. It's looking good. Got this little handle on the back, which is nicer than the usual ones. Bit of a rudder under there, a bit hard to see. This is a storage box. Could turn it into a live well. Now that's the battery box. Put my battery in there. You don't open with that there, unfortunately. If that wasn't there, it'd be just nice and easy to take it straight off. Really nice big area. I've got a 55 amp hour battery in there. You could definitely do much bigger. Some Railblazer Starport mounts there. Raised seat. I've just stashed my old bag there. So, good clips, extra clips to tie some gear on. With a motor kike or a pedal kike, there's always an issue with space. So, that's a good way to make up a bit of space. Just clip some dry bags onto the D-rings. We do have an 8-inch hatch here, which is gold. A lot of the pedal and motor kikes don't have that. So that's really good. We've got the net bag here, which is handy as anything for lip grips and all sorts of things that you use frequently. A bit of a water bottle. Now here again, we've got a nice long track for with four pre-installed mounts for starports. So I put my old starport on there and my rod I haven't used for about three months. Here's the motor. 12 volt, 44 pound motor. Beautiful little com compact small unit that fits straight through the middle there. I haven't put it in because you need to be in shallow water to throw it in. I'll just move it back. Here we got the rudder controls. So I'm going to have to adjust that. Nice and easy to adjust. That was locked. That's locked in. You can move it to suit your length and I'll have to just adjust that cord to make it right. But you, adjust, you steer that with your toes. Battle strap, etc. And a huge big compartment in the front. It just hinges up on the front there. I've got all sorts of crap in there at the moment. but. There we have it, the war horse. Let's see how it goes on the water.